help to me care. I'm in love with a married man. She what? Is this plain? What kind of plain is this, you guys? Exactly. Just months back, you should have seen this, my friend. Ah, ah. Tommy, can say something? What's that? See. See all these girls dating married men. Ah, ah. How do they do it? How? Oh. They don't even have conscience. At all. At all. Oh, my girls of nowadays, eh? <laughs> dating a married man. How? Only God can help us, sir. Only God can help us. Ah, God forbid. No, do it too. I can never do this. I no, can't. God. There's nothing you can tell me. I eh? cannot do this. Okay, my friend, please calm down. Take the story one after the other so I can understand. Okay. So, about three months ago. <sighs> you guys the story so my friend met this guy on a raining day about three months ago i mean she was a damsel in distress and he decided to help you guys wait i didn't ask her one question kike did you know he was married uh, see uh, to be honest i knew that he was married from the first day we met but <laughs> it's just too sweet it's too sweet and compared to to that make a boy ah, I, don't, I don't know i don't know what to do and and it, it wasn't even about sex because he didn't even do anything at first he didn't even try to make any funny moves until about three months after ah, i don't know what to do ha <laughs> You guys, I can understand. He is sweet to the core. Because me self, I collect. I collect a lot. Like 300 cases. Mm. You guys, there is nothing. When I say nothing, I mean nothing he doesn't do. He takes care of her when she's sick. Aww. He sends her money. I mean dollars. He gives her dollars. Pays for our rent too. Every time. I mean, I don't even think our rent was due when he paid. He bought her food like he's always but before my friend even says, I am home. By the time she will say agree, this part is already knocking on her door. Bringing food. What's like is it was just all round. Sweet to the core. You know what I'm saying? You guys, to cap it all, eh? To put a cap. On this story, he bought her a Benzo. Benzima. <laughs> Benz. <laughs> Not all those yeah, yeah Benz you are seeing. No. Correct Benz, you guys. <laughs> so, my friend, what exactly is the problem? The problem is that I'm in love with him. I'm in love with this man. <laughs> And he's even, you know what, what is worse? He's even telling me to marry him. He asked me to marry him. Chinek. And the fact that I'm even considering to, I'm thinking about it. That's, 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 I don't know. What do you think? I don't know what to do. I don't, I don't. Ha! Second wife. Marriage. Ha! My girl. You're a young, beautiful, beautiful girl in her prime. And I really do not think you should be a second wife to any man. Because so many people don't even have their first yet. So why would you go and be a second wife? And aside that, eh, your conscience. Have, have some conscience, really. Because I really do not think you want to be the reason why any woman will be kneeling, praying to God, you know, to remove that person in their marriage or crying. Let you don't want that. Not come to you. The Bible even says whatsoever God has put together, let no man hmm, put asunder. Why do you want to put asunder? Even if he wants you to put asunder, please do not put asunder. Honestly, this is my own opinion. Okay? Abby, 
what do you guys think